Coach Ariel, welcome to the Sports IG. So, Coach, um, una, welcome back to coaching. So, paano nyo ano, may improve? Siyempre, kailangan may improve yung Blackwater for the stop. Paano yung sistema natin, Coach? Well, yun nga, uh, we started na uh, to form the coaching staff and then yun, uh, yung mga players, we made some changes, a lot of changes. Almost half of the team are new faces. So, kaya, yun ang, so we're expecting to make uh, new progress. Kumbaga, so, mm-hmm. so rebound. So, yun nga, rebound from coaching staff, rebound from players and Ano, maribam din yung fortunes namin. Uh, 0-11, pero may import na. So, gaano po importante yung yung integration ng import sa team sa susunod na conference? Very important talaga yung choice ng import kasi talagang kailangan namin yung big man. Kaya pinili namin yung talagang uh, naglalaro sa loob. So, we got Jalen Vaughn to place four or five. So, we play mostly the five for us who talagang will give us inside presence. So, yun talaga yung kailangan ng team. So, with an import conference, may yung makakasurvive kami kasi nga merong, merong kaming panggit na. So, yun ang weakness kasi ng team with Kelly injured din. Uh, probably join us uh, hopefully late December or early January. So, malaking tulong talaga si si Bond, so si James, si Jalen Bond, sa amin. Muntik ng James Bond, ah. Huwag naman maging James Bond coach kasi baka may baril yun. Oh, <laughs> Pero sana ganun yung impact ng mga, di ba? Mm-hmm. Ngayon, Coach, um, pero for you, matagal-tagal ka na rin hindi nagko-coach eh. So, paano yung adjustment sa sa inyo, Coach? Wala, medyo active naman ako. Naging consultant din sa MPBL and then uh, I was uh, with the team din naman. So, and then very active naman ako sa watching the games and analyzing games. So, Baga, ano na lang, so, uh, siguro, it will take uh, you know, a few games or a few quarters para ma-reorient lang siguro. Pero syempre, excited ako for the season, excited ako for the team. Gusto ko na talaga makikita how the team will progress and how the team will uh, evolve. Kumbaga, uh, what we were trying to build, yung chemistry, yung culture, saka yung camaraderie ng mga players. Uh, I'm excited for this sort of squad to to ano to, uh, to perform. So, because uh, I expect uh, uh, I have high expectations for them or for our team. So, yun. Talaga ng excited na ako for this. No bangit nyo kasi bago yung team, new faces, almost half ng team yung bago. So. Paano nyo sila ma, mabubo into one, into one unit, into one system? Good. Um, we've been practicing for the last two or three weeks na yata when we were allowed. Pero before that, we were doing small group workouts and workouts with the individual with our coaches. May mga Zoom workouts. So, now we build them and I'll... Well, we 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 have uh, no, we have practices, uh, and we have a chance to practice with Jalen starting tomorrow. So, uh, blessing then na uh, na move yung opening. Definitely, siguro hindi tayo mago open this weekend kasi wala pa schedule. So, probably next weekend or you know, pagka complete na import. So, that will give us time to ano, to chill. And uh, yung pinili talaga naman namin, yung, kumbaga yung kailangan namin talaga. So we we were before, even before Jalen arrived, uh, sinisimulate na namin kumbaga kung ano yung 
o saan yung puesto ni Jalen on our offense, saan yung puesto niya on our defense. Uh, so, inaasay ko, ito yung import natin, paano natin isa set up, or paano natin, paano na natin, paano niya may uh, matutulungan tayo. So, ganun naman yung ano. So, he's really a, uh, ano, a legitimate big man. Baga. So, hopefully, the ball in ang ibang teams, and we will be able to beat their double team. So, give us a, a threat inside, then, Defensively, he can defend and rebound. So, yun talaga yung, ano, yung sinisimulate na practice. And, inumpisa na rin namin yung culture ng team. Uh, I'm so glad uh, we were able to get uh, uh, J.B. Casio, who's a uh, high, ano, umaga, it's a locker room guy, it's a high uh, uh, culture guy, it's a culture guy, umaga, he, maganda yung So I think na-revive eh. Kung baga na-revive yung ano niya eh. Yung siguro, siguro, dahil sa tagal na rin niya sa Alaska, di ba, uh, medyo yung ibang challenge naman. Kung baga, galing na rin naman sa kanya na ibang challenge yung itong Blackwater. So parang nabuhayan. So yung nakikita ko, JV, eh, he played for me 20... 2009 and 2010, so it's like 11 years ago or 12 years, almost 12 years ago. And nakita ko, mas gumaling pa eh. And I was expecting nga siguro he's, he's um, on his uh, twilight of his career, pero nagulat ako, I think it's still good for two, three more years. Uh, what um, sana yung impact ni L.A. Tenorio or ni Alex Cabagnot or Chris Ross or yung mga almost the same age or even older than him, may ibigay niya sa amin. So maganda yun, in terms of leadership, in terms of kung yung mga kaya na niyang gawin, alam na natin yun, yun kaya, kaya niyang umiscore. So pero yung, kumbaga, yung uh, leadership, yung culture na, na, ano niya, na papasa niya sa team, yung winning mentality, yun ang gusto gusto ko sa ibigay niya kasi ano eh, talagang sa practice, talagang hindi rin papatalo kay Baser yan. Talagang laban kung laban. Mm. Kaya ko, siya banggit nyo na rin po si ano. Actually, itatanong ko na rin yung dalawang yun eh. Itatanong, itatanong ko na lang din si ano eh, si JB at si Baser. So, may anong klaseng problem na meron ka ngayon? You have two top class point guards who deserve to start. So, Paano yun, coach? Isa start mo yung dalawa sabay or palit-palitan? It's a pleasant problem, really. Um, I think they're still competing for the starting spot. Uh, pero sinubukan ko rin na magsabay sila sa practice. Maganda naman yung response din. So, it gives us ano, flexibility with them. And... Uh, Abangan nyo rin si Val Chauka. Maganda rin yung pinapractice. So, so, medyo malalim yung 1, 2, and 3 namin. So, talaga lang doon sa, sa five spot. Uh, doon nga, doon pumapasok si Jalen. So, sa four spot, nandun naman si Barkley and then si, ano, si uh, Will Macaloni na nakuha din na. So, maga, slowly but surely, na-perform na namin yung team na gusto namin. Ngayon ko siya banggit niyo nga po yung ano, yung four spot. Um, yung mga power forward niyo talagang literal na power eh. Um, Barkley, tapos si si Andre. Andre para. So, ang, yung ano niyo, yung, yung core niyo parang nabubuhay sa ano. Yung big man niyo pag nabubuhay sa, sa pagiging, uh, pagiging physical. So, ano yung... Siyempre, malalaman natin rebounding kuha na nila yun. But sa so offense, coach, will you expect more from them? Well, Barkley, we know he can score in the post. And uh, si, si Andre, um, I think he's will be a revelation soon. Uh, maybe... Um, not this conference or uh, not next conference or a few more games. I think Andre just needs a few more games 
uh, kumbaga para mailabas niya talaga yung laro niya. So, Andre, ano eh, uh, never pa nating nakita how he is uh, being played as a stretch for. So, medyo yun ang role na binibigay namin sa kanya, which I think mafit-fit naman niya kasi may shooting yung bata eh. So, sayang yung shooting niya. So, maganda na naman na pino- pina pinupunan yung yung need na yun. yung kailangan yung ano kailangan yung ma ma-prove na yung conference para at least makapag playoffs uh, per- first example eh, break muna namin yung streak and then you know you know uh, ang iniisip ko namin yung ngayon is ano eh to ano, mga palitin muna namin yung game into quarters so try to win quarters try to win ano kumaga first quarter second quarter third quarter fourth quarter so eventually we'll, we'll, ano, we'll pick up wins and hopefully it's good enough to enter the playoffs so yun ang aim namin syempre to enter the quarter finals and pag nando na sa kanya namin na siguro sa kanya namin na mag uh, google pa higher Siyempre yung moral ng team after such a long losing streak, malaking dagok yun eh. So, paano nyo yun ano? Paano nyo, paano nyo ma-erase yung ano? Yung sama ng loob after losing so many games last last conference? Well, we've been trying to correct that in practice eh. Kung baga, yun, yun, doon pa lang sa practice, nakakapag-compete na kami. So, doon pa lang, kinokorect uh, na namin na hindi okay matalo. So, yun. Maganda yung competition sa practice. Uh, uh, lalo na kung dumating pa si Mike Ayon-Ayon, siyempre si, ano, si Rashawn, ayaw din niya yung bigay yung starting spot niya. So, talagang, ano, si Ed Takiwag, uh, Gustor Alba, mga ganyan, mga, talagang mga posisyon nila, ano eh, uh, magkakapareho. Eh. So, doon pala sa practice, uh, sa, within the team, ino na namin na uh, they have to compete for the spot and yun, maganda naman yung spot. So, doon pa lang ma-create yung winning ano, mentality ng mga players. Sa tingin nyo, sino yung ano yung pinakamahirap na challenge nyo for Gov's Cup? Tanggalin na natin yung ma-break yung, yung losing streak. Well, siyempre, it's a, still a young team. It's uh, still developing. So, siyempre, once we get over the hump, kumbaga, yun yung pinakaano namin sa uh, to to be able to, ano, yung ma uh, fully uh, kumbaga, ma uh, fully develop na or ma ano na, masanay na sila sa sistema, yung, sa bagong system, sa kung ano yung gusto namin magawa isa at isa, uh, which we were trying to do nga uh, right now in practice. Siyempre, gusto ko nga maraming tune-up games eh, para ma- ma-testing talaga eh. Pero right now, hindi pa ina-allow ng league. So hopefully, next week, i-allow nila para kung baga ma-test. Yun yung ano namin, yung kung baga ma-test na versus other teams. So yun yung maganda sana mag- mangyari. Yun yung once matest namin versus other teams, ma- masubukan na, ma- ano, kung, kung ano yung kaya ibubuga ba ng team. But right now, we're, we're, we're happy where, uh, with uh, how we develop and how we ano, uh, kumbaga, change or the roster or we make some changes sa roster. Masaya naman kami. Naman. Kasi bumalik ka sa coaching. Okay. Y- yung PBA well well yung buong Pilipinas walang hindi sa normal situation eh so gaano to kahirap na you will build a team in limited practices kasi syempre nga nabanggit mo walang tune up and yung contact sports ang tagal pa bago pinayagan ng government eh Well, it's a challenge, pero kumbaga lahat naman ng teams ay eh, ganun din naman ng predicaments. Kumbaga, we have to, ano, this is a new normal, we have to all uh, adjust. Pero sa maganda rin, sa ABL, ganun din eh, limited preparation din yung mga ano, sa ABL. Yeah, two, two weeks to prepare, ganyan. 
yung mga Malaysian players ko, hindi pa rin available yun. Usually, yung mga nag-work kasi sila eh. So, mga a week or two weeks before lang sila nag-join. And then, yung mga imports will join in. Ganun din eh. So, Um, it's not a new, you know, it's not something new. It's something that I've, you know, I've, I've been, you know, challenged before. So, uh, ito lang, siyempre, iba yung pandemic. Eh, every week, merong testing. Every week, yun, yun, may swab. So, iba talaga yung, ano, iba talaga yung, nagpa-practice ka na may mask. So, medyo, ano, medyo iba. Medyo iba. Walang aircon. So, medyo may mga challenges. Pero, yun nga. Yeah. Lahat naman, uh, dumaan ko. So, so yun. Uh, makita na lang siguro sa games. Hey, Coach, thank you. Sakit sa ilong nun, ha? Every, ano, may swab. Oo. Oh, sanay na ako, eh. Medyo. Lumaki na nga yata yung utas sa ilong ko, eh. Ngayon, Coach, maraming salamat, Coach.